figure. His figure was transformed. And in Uganda we say, So this afternoon, I saw some members of the COVID choir carrying flour from a lorry. And the Varongo and Joseph and Katende, they were all covered with flour. Amen. So now, when these apostles were looking at Jesus, they said, You know what you mean? You're full say. They never expected. Teva subida. Mutivari lava yesu. Mubwa katunda we. Nechitanga la chimuva mu. Nga yinata tegere kika. And the scripture says it was sudden. Do you know, friends, that suddenly God can show you himself? Suddenly the Lord can show himself to you, even without you preparing yourself. Dear friends, it says Jesus took Peter and James and John to a very high mountain. And there they had this experience of seeing Jesus transformed. How many apostles did Jesus have? Wanji? Twelve. Why didn't he take the twelve of them on the high mountain? Wanji Arundamu Avasatu. Peter, James, and John. Can anyone tell me? Wanji? Yari aganzi zanyaba abatuma abasatu. Namu abaganzi zanyo kubali etawamu wale. Okusinga amalabo na abasiga teyo. Kwa yezu mkubile kumu kwa. Banga iti mwosa iti mwiliwa na kubanga mwini so special. Yesu yasanze munti kuku kyo kubeira kumusuzi mwari. And you know it says Jesus took them up to a high mountain. Baba machakutwari chiro. Musima mkende. They didn't know where they were going. But Jesus was taking them higher and higher. Jesus is taking you higher and higher and higher. Be it you look at, be COVID. We have no idea when it's going to end. The two many do we begin to come back. To the young girl, the petrol, the apple, the new one. Baba, to all the people, my new. Oh, but to the girl, wow. Can you not feel to the one? But Jesus is taking you higher and higher and higher. Mukadde kanu, mukama anina jaa kutwara mugana angepani nase. You may not know. You will know afterwards that you are being taken higher. There's somewhere that Jesus wants you to reach. You know, the Lord wants to take you. From sadness to joy. He wants to take you from sickness to health. He wants to take you from poverty to prosperity. He's taking you higher. Say yes, Jesus, take me higher. He wants to take you from rejection to acceptance. Mukama yanga roku kujia wansi yo jora ni de e bange dene aronze mwe simani wacha aronze mwe na ya aronze mwe e akutwara wangu Go with Jesus wherever he's taking you 
It will be wonderful. And it says when they were on the mountain, they saw Jesus as they had never seen him before. Oh, Uganda, when you uh, time in life, when there's a time which comes, where you see something as you have never seen it before. It's the same thing, it's the same place, it's the same person, but there is a transfiguration, there is a transformation. Your eyes are opened to a blessing which you never saw before. Because the Lord has taken you to a higher place. Amen. Our Nina want to tumble and away. Nate and my chichibari. Nay will come again that Okusi would have mass so Kubata will tumble and away. God is good. He will open your eyes and you will know. Whether in business, whether in relationship, your eyes are going to be opened because Jesus is taking you to a higher place so that you can see the future of your life. You know, my friends, the future, thank you, the future, the future is not a miracle. You don't walk into the future. You create the future. Are we together? You create the future. It doesn't just fall from heaven. The choices which you make today, now, are going to determine your future. What choices are you making? What decisions do you have to make now which are going to determine your future? So, this is a moment of revelation for you. Jesus wants to, you to see further than you have been seen. Amina. Because if you don't see it now, you'll never see it. Don't wait for a miracle to see. The future is created by you. God has given you everything you need to create your future. On the mountain, the apostles saw Moses and Elijah talking with Jesus. Suddenly, they have come into the present and are talking to Jesus. Because Jesus is now the prophet of the moment. Because Jesus is the one for this time in your life and my life. And I want to say to you, dear friends, now is the time of your salvation, not tomorrow. Do what you have to do now, not tomorrow. We like procrastinating. Can you say procrastinating? Is that a hard word? Procrastination. It means to say tomorrow. Tomorrow. And tomorrow never comes. Amen. Amen. Today. Jesus is for today. 
The same Jesus who appeared on Mount Tabor has appeared in the Blessed Sacrament and is here. Amen. Now is the time. So we thank Jesus that things are going to be transfigured. So, dear friends, just close your eyes now. Zibirisa. Lord, we ask that you forgive us our sins. Lord, have mercy. And Lord, we pray that you give us patience during this time of Corona. We know you are taking us to a high place. Lord, hear us.